it's your boy Show Off, and we kicking it off with the Rap Shack. Eh. Rush is basically about two cousins that uh, get themselves in a little jam, end up owning a little street debt, and then shit, they pretty much got their little soldiers and start getting that money, you feel me? And you just gotta go check that motherfucker out, though. Go crazy, man. What's been the feedback and shit from it? Everybody loving this motherfucker, man. Everybody loving it. You know, I get a lot of niggas like, oh, bro, I should have been in there, you know. And I'm ready for my acting debut. But, you know, it, it's a lot of shit going on, you know. I got a lot of motherfuckers that's fit to be up in some new shit that I've got coming up. This ain't the, it's only the beginning, you feel me? Mm -hmm. Why should they watch this movie? Hey man, say you should you should watch this movie because it's entertainment. It's gonna keep you in and uh, keep your attention the whole time. Just roll you a little blunt. You feel me? A nice little wood. You feel me? By the time you get done with your wood, you know you are gonna be on the, on the scene with my nigga Hardy R P Hardy. You feel me? You are gonna be on that scene. So, but it's it's entertaining. You feel me? It's gonna keep you in. It's gonna keep your attention and you're gonna see like damn I see some shit like that that happened in the street. You feel me? Same bullshit that's happening out here in these streets. I mean I just put it in a, a better picture for motherfuckers to actually see it. They ain't never been through it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that was a blessing, you know what I'm saying? Uh RP my nigga Hardy, you feel me, TBO. Um it was it was fucked up because we had a whole lot of more shit going on too as well that we couldn't use because it wouldn't have made no sense. You feel me? It would have left y'all like damn, and I didn't want to do my nigga like that. So I made sure I got the best of the best where I could put in there. You feel me? Um, I gave y'all that little blooper at the end of my nigga. My nigga is a real like it was fun working with this nigga like. Hey, turn that shit on. Who the fuck came my house and turned on the jazz? Who the fuck came my house and turned on the jazz, man? Hardy Hell of P is 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 natural for him. Cause he's already like that, you know what I'm saying? So it's hella easy for him. Like the camera could be off and he's still gonna be that same nigga. You feel what I'm saying? So it was like, it was hella fun and and shit. I was just uh, lucky enough to get that before you feel me. He kicked the bucket on us. Soundtrack. I was kicking that shit off like that. Uh, I was I was writing the soundtrack and. As I was writing a soundtrack and I was doing the song, you feel me? I was already painting. It was I was already painting a picture of like a motion picture when I was writing it. You feel me? Every song, like I went. Shout out to Dirty Legion of Doom. You feel me? That nigga go crazy. If y'all look at any interview, you gonna hear show I'll say like niggas always ask me what what producer. Dirty, the Legion of Doom. I, don't, I need to stop telling telling everybody because my niggas starting to get too busy. No, <laughs> 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 no but uh, real talk. So, like, uh, I went up in the studio and, like, I just told Dirty, like, I don't want no beats. Don't send me home with no beats. Mm -hmm. Because that's how I was getting lazy with it. I go home with the beats, you know, write them. You know, I go home three, four beats, and then, then I don't go to the studio probably till like two weeks, three weeks or something like that. You feel me? So 
I was just going into the studio and he blowing a beat up in my face, you feel me? And I already had some shit written out or I'll just blast some shit right there in the moment, you feel me? Mm -hmm. And shit, I just related the whole project around the motion picture that I already was painting in my in my head, you feel me? Mm -hmm. So, but yeah. So uh, I dropped City Rush on October 31st, you feel me? And that's uh, the project, City Rush, the soundtrack. It's out on all digital platforms, y'all you know I mean? And then that motherfucking movie, City Rush, the <laughs> short film going crazy right now. Mm -hmm. It's easy, I mean, I have to find my way, you feel me? Because at, at the end of the day, you still got your family at home, you know? Mm -hmm. So, I, uh, that was a lot of my problems. At first, I was crashing, uh, clashing with my with my family, you feel me? Mm -hmm. Like, shit was happening over there because I was over here too much, you feel me? Mm -hmm. So, I had to learn how to balance that shit out. Like, my clothing, I, I went to... Learning how to do that shit, you know, now I'm making shit like that, pants and shit, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Long pack jeans, we got booty shorts, we got the, the halter tops, we got, you feel me, workout pants, you feel me, everything. And uh, Capture My Show, I did that with uh, my nigga Brad, you feel me? So, like, we just came up with a little name and... And yeah, I wanted to learn how to shoot videos and shoot little shit, you know, do vlogs, do whatever, you feel me? I wanted to learn how to do that. The only way you can learn is by actually putting the camera in your hand and then actually have another nigga that could sh that's been doing it and show you, you feel me? Mm -hmm. Shout out to that nigga Corey B. <laughs> you know what I mean? That nigga showed me a lot of shit. <laughs> You know what I'm talking about? And I got a, a little, few little hidden gems, you know? <laughs> you feel me? <laughs> the boy show off. Go click the uh, subscribe button on that CBSB916 YouTube channel. Go holla at me on IG at show off underscore city rush. We got ball on the way, another short film. We got kings and rush city. Huh? I'm Bruce, man. Yeah, man. Mill, man. Cash Money, Life is Dead. Yeah, man. It's your real boy, D-Lo, man. Yo, you so so. That's Connie Coffee, Janobi. You feel me? Hey, man. You already know it's Mac J. Oh, gee, what you say? Man, it's Mr. Fat. Filthy motherfucking rich. Yeah. This Cash Lord Mitch, man. Blast Squad Mafia. M-O-Z-Z-Y, man. Lil' Derry, y'all. And it's Jacques Styler. You live and direct. Man, you fucking with rap, Shaq. Shack, I'm in the rap shack. Oh, I'm in here with rap shack, man. My fucking rap shack, nigga. Rocking with my rap shack. Man. You hear that? Fuck with rap shack, that was that. Rap shack. Boy, rap shack, man. Fuck with rap shack. Back fucking with the rap shack. Rap shack. Rap shack. Let's gonna get to it, man.